Dear viewers, welcome to 90 Day Fiance Latest News. Watch the full video and give your valuable comments. Thank you. Josh Weinstein and Natalie Mordot Seva's relationship is officially gone, but fans of 90 Day, the single life, are revisiting it. This week, in a scene that was difficult to see, we saw Natalie break up with Josh. Natalie tried to offer Josh an embrace when they met for lunch, but her greeting was anything but kind. After calling Josh weak and becoming extremely cold towards him, Natalie told Josh she didn't want to waste her time on a man who doesn't fight for me, who doesn't care about me. Is this the most awkward hub in hashtag 90 Day Fiance history? TLC asked viewers in a description that included a video of the incident. Viewers of 90 Day, the single life wondered why Josh would ever consider dating someone like Natalie considering her volatile personality and unpredictably fluctuating moods after seeing the show and re-watching the moment on Instagram. Many Instagram critics believed Josh merely dated Natalie in order to gain notoriety from being on a well-liked TLC reality TV program. Josh utilized Natalie for 90 days of TV time. Fans of The Single Life at Layla underscore B concluded, the only reason anyone would put up with her is to be on television. The question of why any man would want to deal with that type of crazy baffled another Instagram user. Maybe he enjoys the TV time, but I'm sure he can do much better, they said, wondering why Josh had put up with Natalie's antics for a full two years. A watcher of another 90 day, the single life speculated that Josh cultivated his relationship with Natalie on television in order to gain attention. I mean, no amount of publicity for your business is worth putting up with this lady, was their reply. Critics of Natalie believe she requires professional help. Some went farther with their remarks, discussing Natalie's mental health and how they believed it might have contributed to her and Josh's breakup. Natalie needs professional assistance, according to one of her detractors, who also questioned why TLC keeps masquerading her around. Natalie's eyes, according to a former employee of a psychological facility, show that she is potentially very dangerous to herself and possibly others. She would be ideal for the part of a serial killer. I already have the natural look, another lover of 90 Day Fiance remarked. Later in the season, Natalie makes a proposal to her ex, Mike Youngquist. Even though Natalie and Josh's romance is gone, we know that Natalie's plot on 90 Day, the single life is still ongoing this season. Natalie turned to a past romantic partner in the hopes of becoming a mother, as Josh was not interested in having children with her. As previously revealed by Monsters and Critics, a sneak peek for this season included Natalie requesting a kid with her ex-husband, Mike Youngquist. During their in-person meeting later in the season, Natalie asks Mike if he would ever consider returning and starting a family. Although Mike's reaction was not seen in the preview, we can assume that Big Mike will not be fooled by Natalie's antics, particularly now that they are no longer together. This gossip is over, if you liked the video, then give your opinion in the comment box and stay with us by subscribing the channel. Thank you.